Okay, so chapter three, Smart Mobile. We are on part four. Cool, so now we are gonna get to the stage we are gonna learn, whoopsie, how to install on an Android device. So taking the configurable model that you built on, in front of you and actually installing it onto a phone or an Android device. So let's get going. So the first thing we have to do is actually connect our phone or our smartphone to the computer using the cable that was given to you. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm busy in, uh, putting my phone in. As you can see here, that there it is. Now what you want to keep in mind that if this comes up, so there's my phone, you need to be able to see the internal shared storage or SD card. If not, then I'll show you on the screen just now how to make sure that it's there. But this means this phone is reading and I can transfer stuff. So the first thing I want to do is left click on field data, go down to smart mobile. So we're not using Cybertracker Classic anymore, we're using smart mobile. First thing I want to do is install smart mobile so the, onto the device. So I left click on this and I go and look for the APK. So an APK is just the extension for an application file that you were given. So the one that you were given in your book is this one. So I left click on it and I left click open. As you can see, there it is there and I left click on install. So the, what the, what it will do now is it will find copy to divide device and now I've actually got to go and run the installation on my device. Okay, so to make it easier for you, I'm showing you my phone here. So what I do is I left click on the menu tab so that I see all the development options. And I scroll down to find the file manager here. So I left click on the file manager. Now it's asking you to go into the internal memory. So internal storage, I left click on that. And if I go all the way down, scroll down, scroll down, there is the smartmobile.apk file. So I left click on it and it's gonna start installing. So what does it want me to do? You just allow access and you click, left click, or click install. So this window is just showing you what's happening on my phone just so that you can see what is going on. It makes life a lot easier. So app installed and then I click open. And what's going to happen is, is as you see the smart is powered by Cybertracker and currently my screen is blank because there is no configurable model on there yet but that's what we are going to do now.